Not long ago, the Ferrari LaFerrari, Porsche 918 Spider, and McLaren P1 were duking it out on the street and track, and they were rightfully christened as the Holy Hybrid Hypercar Trinity. But it's been a while since they last made the headlines, with the F-150 LaFerrari produced between the summers of 2013 and 2018, the plug-in hybrid 918 Spider made between autumn 2013 and the summer of 2015, and the mid-engine P1 also manufactured only between October 2013 and December 2015. Counting the technological advancements in both internal combustion engines and hybrid powertrains, these three feel like dinosaurs from an extinct era to some. No worries if you want something incredible that's almost as good as a Le Mans racer, but with technology borrowed from Formula One, there are a couple of options if you hurry up. For example, you could snatch one of the 275 planned units of the Mercedes-AMG One, the limited production plug-in hybrid hypercar featuring F1 technology and input from the seven-time F1 world champion Lewis Hamilton himself. It started production last August and features a 1.6-liter hybrid e-turbo V6 along with electric motors for a combined output of 1,049 horsepower. Also, there's the hybrid Aston Martin Valkyrie made by the British automaker in collaboration with Red Bull Racing Advanced Technologies and many others. It also started arriving on the market since late 2021 and features even more oomph, 1,160 horsepower thanks to a naturally aspirated 6.5-liter Aston Martin Cosworth V12 and an electric motor. Interestingly, the progress achieved by technology is pretty obvious in the fact that Lamborghini's Aventador successor, the all-new Revuelto Supercar, is almost as powerful as these other two, 1,001 horsepower from a 6.5-liter V12 and three electric motors. Naturally, Ferrari couldn't stand idle and decided to respond to these attacks with the Ferrari SF90XX, Straight Ale and Spider. PHEV supercar, its enhanced powertrain now has 1,016 horsepower, just 15 ponies more than the Revuelto foe. However, Ferrari seems keen on reinstating the Holy Trinity alongside the Mercedes-AMG One and Aston Martin Valkyrie this time, as our spy photographer partners recently caught a Ferrari hypercar while testing. Tentatively dubbed F250 to denote it as the successor of the, in, famous LaFerrari, this new sports car flagship probably hides a V6 surprise to also adhere to the new Formula One lifestyle. Naturally, the rumor mill quickly took notice of all the facts and figures, and then asked the imaginative realm of digital car content creators to help them envision the unofficial looks of the next Ferrari hypercar flagship. The good folks at Kalisa, along with their resident pixel master Nikita Twiko, aka Kelsonek on social media, are among the first to render the hypothetical model, complete with 296 GTB-inspired looks, albeit on CGI steroids. Well, it remains to be seen if this will pan out, but as far as we can tell, the CGI expert was pretty keen on adhering to the prototype's design lines. So, do you like it or not?